we figured out what perm ratings are and what they stand for and how we can use them. Now let's figure out the perm rating scale. What does the number that you see actually mean? The scale's generally broken down into four different tiers. The first level is the vapor impermeable or vapor barrier. That's when you have a perm rating of 0.1 or less. Those are materials like polymembrane, essentially no vapors uh, transmitting through them. Then there's the second level, the vapor semi-impermeable, 0.1 to 1.0 perms. These are going to be materials like OSB sheathing or EPS foam. Then there's level 3, the semi-permeable. Those are 1 to 10 perms. Materials like plywood or uh, fiber-faced uh, isocyanurate insulation. They're pretty vapor open, but not the most open. Now, the most open would be category 4, vapor permeable materials. So that's a perm rating of 10 or more. Those would be materials like blown in cellulose, very vapor open, letting the vapor go through. There's kind of a fifth, fifth category, and that's the vapor variable. Plywood is a material that when wet is actually more vapor open than when bone dry which means that they're, they can sort of play double duty. They can be vapor open and vapor closed depending on the conditions, which is a clever little trick we can use to really make our wall assemblies even more robust. 